Okay. Go to your email, Gmail, and open up the email with the newest listings in it. Download the newest listing. Okay, once you've downloaded it, you can close the browser out. Then go to your folders. Click on downloads and your new listing file should be in here. Look for the new listing and open it up. Okay, this is what it's going to look like after you've edited it. But I'm going to open a file now that has not been edited yet, which will look similar to what you've downloaded in the new email. You can see it's a little different. It's missing a column. You don't have a names column in here. So, first of all, right there is where your names column should be you can't edit it so right in this area here you'll see where it says make editable click on that and you'll be able to edit this file now right click on this column and click insert okay now at the top there type in actually let's go ahead and just delete this one too delete the top column because you need to get that out of there okay now type in name and then the next column down type in to our neighbors now copy and paste down all the way down to the last row there and then once you've done that save the file you can close out the file if you want you don't need it to be open okay now what you want to do is go back into documents go into Gold Coast moving and storage Excel mailing list mailing list word file and then open the mailing list envelopes number 10 that's the size of the envelope that you're going to be printing so double click on that open that up it's going to give you this box click on yes and then you'll see what the layout of the envelope will look like we already got the um, Gold Coast moving and storage address up in the top left and then to our neighbors address box in the middle so go up to the top click on mailings okay and then you're gonna click on select recipients and use existing file now go find that file that we just edited and saved double click on that click OK alright and then once you've done that everything should be um, all done correctly click on finish and merge print the documents click OK you want to click all and then make sure that the printer which is the new one, the 8710 is selected and green. Click OK. And then once you've pressed OK, it'll start printing the, uh, the envelopes. So before you do that, make sure that you have the envelopes in the printer and correctly positioned in there. Remember, don't put too many in there. Once you've done that, you're finished and good to go.